Welcome back to 242 Math. I am your host, Raphael Thompson. And today we are looking at grade 6. This is GLAT revision for grade 6. So, students, here we go. Question 1. Complete the table. And the table is made up of words, Roman numerals, and numerals. So you have LIX, change that Roman numeral to a numeral and change it to words. 140, change to a Roman numeral and change it to a numeral. Question two, look at the box. A, what is the exponent in three to the X? And B, what is the value of X? Question three, circle the shapes with more than two lines of symmetry. Question four, draw the next figure in the pattern shown below to complete it. Question 5. Use the angles above to match the names below. A. Obtuse angle. B. Right angle. C. Reflex angle. Question six, use the shapes to answer the following questions. A, write a mixed number fraction for the shaded parts. B, convert the fraction in A to an improper fraction. C, write the reciprocal of the fraction in B. Question seven, circle the shapes that are similar. Question 8. Use the spinner to answer the following questions. A. What is the probability of landing on a number that is a factor of 10? B. What is the probability of landing on a number that is a prime number? Question 9. Complete each table to show the relationship between the units. A would be metric units and B is imperial units. Ten. Use the coordinate grid to answer the following questions. A name the object at the point four, five, and B. Write the coordinates for the flag. Answers coming up. Here we go, grade six. Question one, LIX is 59, and CXL, 140. Question two, the exponent in three to the X is X, 
and the value of x has to be 2. 2 to the 3 is 8. 8 times 3 squared is 9. 8, 9, 72. Question 3, the shapes with more than two lines, it says more than two lines of symmetry, so it can't be the rectangle. So it has to be the square and the circle. The circle has an infinite number of lines of symmetry. The triangle there would have one, the rectangle would have two. Question 4, the first shape, you turned it 90 degrees up, turn it 90 degrees again, it's across, turn it 90 degrees and it would be down. Question five, an obtuse angle in the angles would be 145 degrees. A right angle is 90 degrees and our, the reflex angle from the angles above would be 300 degrees. Remember obtuse is between 90 and 180. Right angle is 90. Reflex is between 360 and 180. Okay, A, the shape is one and three tenths. That's the fraction. The improper fraction 13 tenths and then the reciprocal would be 10 10 thirteenths you just flip it circle the shapes that are similar it would be the first two those two are right angle triangles it cannot be the last one because that would be congruent to the first one so only those two at the front they would be similar And 8 was probably landing on a number that's a factor of 10, 1, 2, and 5, and other numbers there are the factors, the 3 8s. And landing on numbers of prime numbers, prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7. So I'll be 4 8, which is a half. Question 9 2,500 millimeters is 2.5 meters, and 66 inches divided by 12 is 5.5 feet. Five and a half or two and a half, same thing. Question 10, name the object at the point four five, that's a boat, a sailboat, and B. The coordinates for the fly would be, look along the bottom, three, and then along the side, eight. Three comma eight. That's it, grade six. Hope you got all of them correct. If not, you'll have a next one coming up shortly. And God willing, I will see you in the next one. That's a wrap.